July 13th, 2019. I'm coming home. <laughs> Delaware, here I come. Suitcase, check. Carry on, check, check. Coffee, check, check. check. Boyfriend, check. He ain't coming, who are we kidding? All right. Bye, I'm gonna make this a big vlog. Woohoo! Guys, I just ran into Mila Kunis and Ashton Kutcher at freaking the coffee shop, standing next to her. Couldn't really talk, it was really fun. Oh my gosh. I walk out, she's still in there, but then I forgot a fork and a knife for my salad for the for the airport. So, I go back in, walk out right behind her, she probably thinks there I'm stalking go. her. Nice oh, they're right in front of us. Catch up to them. And of course, who's picking her up? None other than her husband, Ashton. I make eye contact with him. Eye he contact. smirks at me. Woohoo! And then that was it, but it was awesome. Like a nice smirk though. It was like a nice smirk and they had a baby in the car. Day made. All right, it's a good start to this travel vlog. Whoop, whoop. All right team, here's the rundown of my life. So I'm flying home to Philly, which is like 25 minutes from where I live in Delaware. So fly to Philly, go into LAX now. Step one, get in the car. Step two, get snacks. Stop three, the airport. Then I go with my big pink suitcase. So I'm a carry on, get on the plane, try my hardest not to fall asleep, but I'm literally pass out. Two seconds, we'll find out. I'll vlog it, but I'll probably be embarrassed. But my chances are pretty high because literally yesterday, I slept a full day. I fell asleep at regular time, woke up at like 11, went to this music video shoot for my boyfriend, who's awesome. So proud of him. Was awake for a couple hours, did some work, and then was gonna work out at 4.30, so mind you, I've been awake like four and a half hours. Get in bed, fall asleep till 7.30 at night. Cool. Usually that sets me off and I'm just awake until three in the morning, but this time fell asleep at 12.30 and woke up and it at like right before at 6.45. So I slept the whole day away yesterday. So hopefully that means I have energy for the day and can fight the good fight and stay awake in the plane, but that's really hard. And that person just saw me vlogging and that's an old man. So, you know, he thinks this is weird. Anyway, um, get on the plane, get home, take an Uber to my house. Cause obviously my parents are vacationing and not here. And then here's the sitch. We're going to go home, do my Star Spangled Banner gig, then try to go around the whole city and put out flyers for my hometown show, which is like in two weeks. It's gonna be chaos. And and I'm already, don't want to think about it. But yeah, that's it, and then I come home. Okay, love you, bye. Bye, boyfriend. I love you. Mm, you smell good. Okay, time to go. Oh my gosh, I literally just got home and I'm standing on the grass and I already am, I'm literally surrounded by piles of freaking dog poop. If it's in my shoes, let's check. Somehow I avoided it, wow. All right, welcome to Delaware. Woohoo, wow, it looks really green. Delaware, are we? Okay. Woohoo, this is my home. Wow, I haven't been home in the summer in so long. All right, should we go say hi to my family? Let's do it. Hello, family. Family's lived here since 1999. We lived down the street when we moved to Delaware in 1996. And I was three. Here we go, let's knock on the door. Ding, I hear the doggies. Hello! <laughs> say hi. I'm <laughs> Roxy. Tookie, tookie, tookie. Woohoo. We're home. Delaware home. James is home. Doggies are home. Woohoo. Uh. Oh, okay. And here's my Tony. Little tiny girl. Hi, my baby. I love her. All right, guys. Welcome to my Delaware home. I was born in California. I moved to Delaware when I had just turned three years old. And we moved to a house down the street. Then we moved here when I was six in 1999. And we lived here ever since. And I'm going to give you a really quick house tour. No one asked for it, but. Look in the fridge, let's see what we got. I have no food in my fridge, I'm a serial killer in LA. Mm, let's see, we've got, this is a Snapple drink that I'm used drinking. My mom thinks, cause no one drinks this, she just puts her mouth to it and makes you wanna hurl. But there was no other options. Drink stuff, food, eggs, yogurt. It looks pretty healthy, like whoa. You wanna see the junk drawer though? We have an insane amount of trail mix right now, which is so bizarre, wait. Have you ever seen a thing of Quaker Oats this big? <laughs> Look, this is this is the junk food closet. It used to be so much worse. When I was growing up, we had the junk food. Pop-Tarts, Toaster Strudel, so many bagels, Lucky Charms, Fruity Pebbles, Captain Crunch. Get at me, okay. So this is the kitchen. Woo woo. Ooh, look, this is the creepy wall with so many photos. James drew this. This is the table that we have all done our homework on for about 55,000 years. See all the family photos. My dad goes literally apeshiz with that stuff. And then these are the creepy Brady Bunch couches that my mom did got one time. This is the family room. Woo -woo. Family room meets kitchen is where we spend all of our time. There's a computer over here that little Jamesy, when he was about three years old, once pulled on himself and it was so cute. Oh, Jamesy, come to the pool with me. There's Stella on the couch. Ooh. 
The lighting is blue. Creepy. Welcome to the backyard again. Okay, this is our little pool house. Ding, ding, ding. Actually, it's the garage. We've got the pool, which is always so dirty. We've got these little bed things. We've got the sunroom with a creepy, creepy, creep painting that I did. I was in high school. See that creep, creep, weird painting that's like not finished? Yeah, I did that. Okay, let's go. We're gonna move from the kitchen to this dark, freaky hallway where there is no underage drinking. To another, the tiny room. We love the tiny room. This is where I spend most of my time here. To another wall with lots of photos. And then, this is the sunroom where apparently James told me that I planted this jade tree a long, long time ago. I guess it's still really big and awesome. There's my scary thing again. These are my dad's plants. They all scare me because I feel like there's bugs. And James said that he's planted a lot of these. Right, Daisy? Uh, yeah. You happy that I'm home? Yeah. On a scale of one to 10, how happy are you that I'm home? 10. Woo! Me too, okay. And then I'm gonna show you one last thing. This is the bathroom, whoa, next to the tiny room that says, wait, they took to all my friends and family. We had a sign here for like 15 years that said, if you sprinkle one, you tinkle, be a sweetie, wipe the seed. Right here. And it's gone. Yeah. Mother, why would you do that? Grandfather clock, all very creepy and all. Front door, and this is the dining room. And that's pretty much the first floor for you. Bye. All right. I'm drinking my mom's backwash snapple. Okay guys, welcome to my kitchen. Um, first thing on the agenda is I got a cameo request to do Chubby Bunny, so I'm gonna take you along for this ride too. All right. Chubby Bunny. Ah, uh, here we go. Okay, cameo. She choking? The dog? Toto? Is she okay? The dogs are getting sick. Hey Jessica and Siobhan. Happy birthday, Jessica, on Monday. For your birthday, Siobhan asked me to do a chubby bunny challenge, so let's do this. Okay. Chubby bunny. Chubby bunny. Oh, it's so good. Chubby bunny. For the record, I got four in there. Bye. Money in the bank. I love you, I miss you. Hi, my honey. We love a little doggy moment. I love you, poo poo. All right, team. So, James and I just found Got Milk cookies and cream straws, or they're weird, and you put them in milk, and you mm. They smell good, there's like cookie bits in there. It tastes like cookies and cream, and they're like six years old. We wanna try them, but we wanna see if they're expired. Must be over three years old to drink this. Sip a cookies and cream straw into a fresh glass of milk and sip. All right. Can't seem to locate expiration date on this thing, which means they don't expire, right? right. Be right back when we find out if there's an expiration date or not. Back with an update. So. Couldn't find an expiration date, so we figure there is none. So James is gonna try, he's gonna do it. He's gonna be the victim. Oh, the milk was expired though, so this is what you do in Delaware. You look in your fridge and your cupboard and you're like, dang, is this expired? Let's try it out and see if we get sick. Step one, pour milk into cup. Dang it, there's a thing. Pours milk. Okay, nice. Now, second step is what? You put straw into milk. Oh yeah, let me get a good angle there. Go. All right, good luck. Is it working? No. Is it good? Yeah, it is. Mainly like milk, but has some like chocolate flavor in it. Chocolate flavored milk, we did it, cookies and cream. <laughs> it's not too bad. We'll see if you get sick tomorrow. Otherwise, just so you know, these cookies and cream things last about a decade, so if not more. So they're good for the inevitable earthquake that's gonna because I'll stay underground. All right, that's the first event of the day. Probably the last one. We'll probably watch a movie. What are we watching? Okay guys, day two in Delaware. We're all dripping. Just kidding. We're going to Best Buy, that's our road trip for the day. We're going to get a memory card for this vlog camera and also an external hard drive. And we're gonna get coffee and drive around in my mom's car and it's super freaking hot outside. It's 87 degrees and humid. <sighs> I can barely breathe, all right, we're going. Hasta la vista, baby. <laughs> hey guys, the crazy roads of Delaware. Ooh, vroom, vroom. We're passing the school I went to called Tower Hill that I went to when I was kindergarten to 12th grade, now turn it. That's the football field, right? James and I used to run track. We 
We used to go in there every morning. I was always late. Is it good? Yeah, it's really good. Mm. Delaware knows what's up with this iced coffee and extra soy milk and extra ice. Okay, bye. Over the river and through the woods to Best Buy we go. Hey guys, we're at Best Buy. We're so excited to be here, right? But we realized if we bring in my camera, we'll feel like we're stealing it. So we're looking to see what size my memory card is and then we're not gonna bring it in because, because why? <laughs> we're at a loss for words. Okay, bye. James, how'd we do? Did we get everything we needed? Yeah. Were there any distractions? Yeah. Uh, what pink, happened? pink keyboard that you wanted to buy. We don't have enough money for it. The pink keyboard I need to buy. I need, not want, to buy. Should I try to get it? Was it worth it? Probably not, but sure. <laughs> It was beautiful, insert footage of keyboard right here. Anyway, I honestly can't imagine leaving Delaware without it now. You can order it online. <laughs> My sensible brother. 10 years younger, but 10 years smarter, right? Available. We're over the river and through the woods and now we're gonna go back over the river and through the woods to home. All right, we're dying in the hot car. What are we doing, James, where are we? I actually don't. We're at FedEx <laughs> Kinko's, whoop, whoop. We're trying to print out posters for this concert so that we can distribute them so people come. Tell everybody your theory. Right. It's flawed. The FedEx is flawed, he said. What we did is we ordered a bunch of stuff, right? And we were ready to pay and we were ready to pick up because he ordered, but instead he's like, actually we can't have it ready until like a couple hours minimum or something. And James is like smart and he's like, well, that doesn't make sense because people could go in there, order a bunch of copies and then never pay for them. And what a waste of paper, right? Anyway, we're having a grand old time hanging out. We did errands and now the day's done. I've been out for about an hour. Bye. Hey, we're back. Look how cool. They're cool, right? They're big. And then, we got medium size. And then we got small size. Let's go to the show. Hey guys, we're on a walk. And this is our old home that we moved to. This is my first home in Delaware, right here. It used to be light blue. When I was three years old, we moved here. And we lived there for like three years. Yes. There it is, but it used to be light blue. This is live. I'm in my pajamas. <laughs> it's not live. Oh, okay. This is what we eat every day at this household. Hi. Yay! Here's my little bedroom. Sunflowers, random things. This is basically what it looked like. There used to be a dress over there until my sister stole it. Bathroom. Margie, Margie, toot, toot. This is it. Hey guys. My voice is mainly low. It's 8.30 a.m. on the East Coast, so it's 5.30 a.m. my time. I'm going in to get a blowout. Well, my hair's already dry. They're just gonna style it for me. Cause I'm singing in the national anthem today! Uh, Classic little, looking like Lil Bo Peep right now. It's like, I know what I'm doing. Don't look at me when I walk out of the freaking salon. I'm gonna go get ready for the Star Spangled Banner, and I gotta warm up because my voice is so freaking low right now. It sounds like a boy. Bye. Here we go. We're going to the Star Spangled Banner. Hair already fell out. This dog, Stella, every time I've been singing, she watches and she howls. It's so cute. Oh, hi. <laughs> She's cute, cute. She's sweet as dog. We went on three walks yesterday. Look at her. Okay. Everybody say hi. Hi. Francine, hi. Dad, hi. Alice, Mom, <laughs> and Gran right here. She's really tiny. <laughs> All right, we're going to we're the Star Spangled Banner thing. Let's go. Woo -hoo. Woo -hoo. Gran, do you have anything to say? No. She's right. Hey mom. Hey. <laughs> I'm gonna drop you guys off. Yeah, we gotta drop no, Grant just off. No, just We have to drop Grant off. Right. Drop no, she Why? doesn't want to be dropped, dropped off. That's a long way to walk. It's fine. It's okay. she wants to. 100 feet. Grant, do you want to get, get dropped off? No. She's right. Right no, I'll be James. fine. I can walk. Head southwest toward no. Limestone Road. I think the entrance is right up on the left. We'll never get here. Get out of the seat. <laughs> and we're here. Yeah. Looks like our house. We're here. Dad's looking out. Feel free to wave hi. 
We're at Harfell. We're gonna sing the national anthem in a couple minutes. It's crazy here. Anyway. Woo! This is Bryn. She's responsible for all of this. We're cousins. We're cousins. We're cousins. But also best friends. We're so excited to have Margie Mays here. Woo! Oh hey, do you guys wanna be in my YouTube video? No. She's right. yeah. <laughs> What's your name? Hi, I'm Rachel Martin. Time to do some golfing. Oh yeah, are you gonna play? No. No. Hey, 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 Say hi. Hey guys. Hi. Hey, Adelaide just dyed her hair and it looks so good. She looks like an actress. Hi, will you will you hold this? Will you video it? Hi, how are you? Madison, what's your name? Why did you trust Wyatt? We had you. Oh, you're so tiny. How old are you guys? Seven years old. How old are you? Do you want to take a picture? I'm gonna take one with my sunglasses off. This is what I really look like. So, the bravest fan I've met so far. Oh, it's upside down! Oh! Oh, yes! Sorry! Get on the cheek! It's upside down! Oh my god. Oh, it actually worked. Do you see it? Now I have two stamps. Two stamps! Hey, you've been stamped. Oh, yeah, you're the first one. You're the bravest. I'm sorry that it's not as good. White tea markers and for baby. Hi, it's me, your boy Wyatt. Subscribe to my YouTube channel if I ever make one. It's so. gonna be called Alec in yeah. the back. That's not very great. Alec, get in the ow. <laughs> that that wasn't nice. This is my cousin Margie. What's who hey. is that? Who, who's Margie? Got my sister Adelaide. I don't know where she's at. Adelaide, get in this picture. Best thing that could have happened. Recording. Thank you for that. I'm a YouTuber now. Does that look better? I don't know. Get in the video. Give me this. No more responsibility. I want to see. You want to say hi? That's not saying hi, Kay, Alec. Hey! We're getting VIP service here at Hartfeld. We're getting a red carpet ride. She's so excited to be on the camera. This is going to be a good vlog. We got a lot of good stuff coming up. Oh, today. yeah, exactly. All right. My cousin Bryn is just as crazy as I am. I think she was in this earlier, so my mom's going to imitate her because she, too, is an actress. Okay, here we go. I'm in the bathroom. Bryn is in the bathroom. She's trying to pee. She gets a phone call about a house for sale because she's a realtor, but she's also organizing this volunteer golf charity event. She's like, oh, yeah, that'll be fine. I don't think they're going to take that deal because mute. <laughs> Um, but they might, but I'm not really sure. But can I get the con I'm, I'm organizing the big golf charity event. Margie Mace is singing the national anthem. But hold on for one second. <laughs> oh, oh my I gosh! She didn't do that. She didn't say it. And then oh. I'm like, oh. She is such, she was so good. Oh. She's such a multitasker. A realtor are running a major charity event and ping at, at the, the same, same time. time. That's her That's mother right girl. there. There she, she is. <laughs> this is what happens in Delaware, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> Olivia and that's Juliet right there. Look at them come to me. They're 12 days apart. <laughs> you are so beautiful, Juliet. Ooh, ooh, ooh. We're gonna go see the puppy. Wow. Oh, oh, there's Margie with Juliet's waving. That is cool. Hello, Delaware. <laughs> Sunset. Dad's driving. <laughs> What up, what up? Last day here, just did so many posters for the show and cut them up. Crazy. Everyone better be coming to the show. But the best part is I just sent a personalized one to my biggest fan, love from Margie, to camp. So she's gonna get it and hopefully she's gonna be really happy. Shout out to you, Ava. Love you. Best, most dedicated fan. Ava, look out for this. Shout out. You're the best. This Bruja coffee is so good. It's called Bruja. It's my last day with you for a while. Hi, Papa. Toto's wheezing. Hi, my baby. Hi, buddy. 
she walked today, so she's tired. This is my mom watching my social media. This is what she does all day, every day. And so you can see you do that again. Come on, ready? Where is it? Stop it. Today's the day I go home. I love you, Stella. Bye, wee baby. Bye, Delaware. <laughs> Bye, honey. I love you. I'll see you in a couple weeks. Bye. Bye. Reporting for duty, we made it to LA with Flayboys. And my phone's dead, but it don't matter. We found each other because we know each other's shapes and we know each other's hot tubes pulled. And we said, he's here. He found me. And now we're going to eat. Bye. All right, thank goodness he's here because I'm starving. I thought I was going to eat my full stomach out. No food. You were hungry? What? Check in there. What? Chips and salsa in the car. Hey, guys. So. Hey, guys. Um. Hey, guys. Hey, guys. So I just wanted to let you know that I filmed that clip when I found the chips and salsa on July 17th, 2019. And today is August 13th, 2019. And I just realized it's still in my middle console of my car. It's never been moved. So I'm a vile human. Anyway, love you. Like, comment, subscribe. I just had to admit it, because why not? Bye. I'm not gonna move, I'm gonna let you know when I move the chips. It's not gonna be for a long time. Flushed away. That's good.